with it. All right, let's fucking keep going. We look more like a bum than ever. Let's do this. Okay, what's what's this though? A garden hose. This won't be of use until the snow melts. All right, let's get in this. There must be another way into the digging. What the fuck was that? Did you just speak into a microphone, Kim? What was that? Try that again. Did anyone else hear that? That sounded really weird. So much for a quiet smoke. Shut up up there! I'm just trying to break into your building. If you would just let me in, then I wouldn't be making so much noise. Freaking douche. Okay, I guess we're not going into the building from that side. Oh, what do we got here? Trash bin? It's locked? No. uh Can you use my crowbar or something? Mm -hmm. Let's see. Crow hey. Oh, hey. The fuck? Shut up. <gasps> Whoa! I got a coat. Signal blue navy coat. Oh! Ooh! Ooh! What? Tell me all about it. Plus one to suggestion and a minus one to half light. Is it better? Yeah, my, my jacket gives me the corpse, though. Hmm. Does it look... Oh, my goodness. Look at that. That's sharp. That's sharp. Okay, let's pop it on for a little bit. What's this? <gasps> Yay. What the hell is that? Rue de Saint-Gelaine, roundabout north. Look okay. Sh who? It hey! Relax up there, would you? Holy jumping! What do you want? The streets will flow red once more. A great torrent rushing down Rue de Esperance. You wait and see. Oh, good. I can. Uh, I'm glad to see we got another very normal person here. Cindy the Skull. Yeah, that's what you're going by, eh? Alrighty then. The streets will not flow red with anything. Who are you? Yeah, you tell her, Kim. I'm Cindy the fucking Skull. What else do you want to know? Date of birth. Blood type. The last time I was tested for Hep C. <laughs> Hep. Yeah. When were you last tested? Had a battery of tests just last week. Oh, good. I'm practically a patchwork of interesting critters. Oh. Kinda like a man of war. Oh. Despite the attitude, she puts the brush aside. Oh, that's nasty. She's got, she's got freaking crabs, bro. I mean, I ain't fucking around with no crabs, dog. She's grown frustrated with her work and welcomes the opportunity to challenge authority in other ways. Speaking of crabs, I have a little funny story. Uh, back in high school, you know, we had that classic situation where like two schools were meeting and they were gonna meet at the fucking park or whatever for a fight. And, like, everyone's circled around, and, like, there's a video that was going around, and it was just, like, someone panning around the crowd, and it just, like, you catch a perfect glimpse of my buddy Chris going, he's just sitting there scratching his freaking crotch, he's like, oh, man, I think I got pubes! <laughs> it's just, that was way better than the fight, the fight was lame, but, yeah, that the pubes was great. Uh, anyway... She's, she's grown frustrated with her work and welcomes the opportunity to challenge authority in other ways. You keep looking off to the side. What are you looking at? What are you doing to the wall? Do you know anything about the recent murder? Yeah, I murder. I snitch, pigstein. Go forth and forage in someone else's shit. No shortage of squealers in these parts. Well, if you didn't want to talk, then why were you yelling at me from your balcony to come talk to you, for God's sakes? Actually... There is a shortage of people who talk to us in a normal, calm, informative manner. You hear that, Cindy? A shortage. A shortage, Cindy! We weren't put on this earth to make your life pleasant, fucko. F Call me a fucko? You a fucko? Uh, what you doing to the wall there? Is that blood? Can't you tell? I'm painting a beautiful mural. An aereo graffitio visible from low orbit. Honestly, I, I'm fine with graffiti if it's tasteful and, and, like, actually artful. It's very cool. I just don't like the tags and stuff where people are just throwing up their gang symbols. Like, that's lame. Like, if they do an actual art, then I'm cool with it. It looks usually it's very, very good. I haven't really started it yet. I'm waiting for the right words. She studies the wall suddenly, pensive. So you don't know what to write. Why are you so committed to defacing the building? I have an opinion on this. Want to hear it? Yeah. I love public art. Don't mind us. Keep doing what you're doing, girl. 
I'm gonna have to stop you. This is hooliganism. Actually, I don't have an opinion. Eh, go for it, girl. I don't care. It's a war-torn city. Who cares? I'm sure the inspiration will come to me now that I have an official RCM stamp of approval. Just don't fucking throw me as a piggy up there on the wall. That'd be very uncool. You've lessened her desire to deface the building. Hooray. Uh, what you looking at? The lieutenant furrows his brow at another one of your eccentricisms. Oh my. A boat? Hatred? Disgust? It's difficult to tell which of the two is more present in her girlish features. The woman on the boat does it's not a woman. notice her steering. Not gonna lie, that kind of looks like a dude. That is on her. Someone's got to keep an eye on her. Ooh, a whore. Who is she? Probably the Wild Pines rep. We should talk to her. Wild Pines She's rep. a professional negotiator, though. I have the feeling she will be very cooperative while telling us nothing. Well, if she's the cooperator, why the fuck is she sitting over here alone on the boat? Why isn't she over there dealing with the protests? You should take the lead. Ask her unexpected questions, you know? Do your thing. Yeah, that's Don't what be I afraid do. to get a bit wacky. Throwing her off is our best bet. Indeed, Kim, I like that. Good idea, piggies. Run along now. Fuck her shit up good. Impound that boat while you're at it. I'd like to watch her swim back to us on. <laughs> uh, all right. Thanks, Cindy. Watch your back, ungulate. You've got eyes on you. Well, that's terrifying. Ah, wish you never said that. Okay, what's... what? You got something for me to look at or something? Eh? Eh? Oh man, look at all the tasks we've, we've gotten now. Just on Monday! Found out who is in the Union Bar. Oh yeah, we're gonna have to go back there. What time is it? Ooh, it's like 3. We're gonna have to run back there. Check that out. Inside the frame of, motor of a motorcycle in repair and tools used to disassemble it. Oh, there's like so many bottles right there. Grab that. Get that right now, man. Grim. I want them all. Thank ya. Thank ya. Oh, we're so gonna have enough money to get a McDouble. So hungry. Okay, wait. Before, I think I want to go back to the Whirling Inn before we go too far and it gets too late. Looks like there was more construction here once decades ago. Okay. We'll return to this area in a moment. But first, I think, uh, the, rather, at least the kitchen should be open at the hotel, and or the union dudes should be in there by now. So come on, Kim! Let us go! Hold on, was there more any more bottles around? There's, like, totally bottles down there. I know there's bottles down here. I need it. I need the bottles. Go into the trash. Yeah! How about that? Oh yeah! Is that a bottle? Is that a thing right there? What's that? Oh, oh, oh! It's a thought! The sight of bottles oh. stirs something in you. No, Make no, no! The Don't look sight. at him close, they'll hurt me again. Look, Kim, look! Bullet holes! Where? There! There? Those are old. Oh. What do you mean old? These bullets were fired during the revolution, over half a century ago. They do not warrant investigation. We should focus on present Fine. crimes. Whatever. Got some experience. Dun 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 dun. Give me the bottle. Give me the bottle, please. Yeah. Oh, there's another one. My good. This place is disgusting. There's bottles everywhere. Bottles everywhere. What's that? Another little bottle? Oh yeah. Fucking rich. More bottles. Oh, fucking right. Okay, into. Uh, what's that? Just a sign, I think. Where are we? Where are you going? Street sign reads Fuck the police. Fuck. Fuck. Fuck the police. Fifteen bucks, little man. Put that shit. In my hand. Whoa, there's a new dude. <gasps> okay, well, the union isn't here, but the kitchen's open now. Who's this guy? This guy's new. My man. I'm gonna walk all the way around and come talk to you. Better get ready. Here it comes. Oh, it's all about the money, you know. Well, that was disappointing. 
Into the kitchen! Ha! The dishes are drying. They smell of chemicals and pine trees. Nasty. Set. A dollar fifteen! Holy jumping! We're rich! Three dollars and seventeen cents, y'all. An aroma of spices, alcohol, and tomato hangs in the air. Ooh, a door. Hello, sir. Mr. Cook? A thin man sir. is smoking below an exhaust hood, occasionally sipping from his mug. This must be the Whirling's cook. Well, he looks like a standard cook. As you step in, he nods toward the table and says something in a completely foreign language. The only words you can make out are Garanzi and Kubek. Okay. It must be his name. Garanzi. Garanzi Kubek. Sounds representative. <laughs> Mr. Kubek, I'm here on official police business. The man puts his cup down and replies something, his left hand drawing arcs in the air. Got some impressive pots here. He smiles and bangs his ladle against each of his pots in turn. Okay, well it seems like he kind of understands me. I don't think I need any... I, I don't think I need anything else. Stay masculine. Uh, thanks, my man. Thanks, mommy. Ooh, what's that? What you got over there? Yoink. Photos of men in overalls toting guns and union placards. Oh boy. They have weapons, the union. You see a heavy steel door with a prominent dimpled lock. It's painted blue. You immediately feel drawn to the color. Blue is for mystery. Touch the door. The cobalt blue surface feels rough to touch. The stainless steel door is flush with its frame on every side. I wonder where it leads. You do? Yes. It's a door in the back of the kitchen. Why do you care where it leads? It could lead to the murder mystery. Answers and stuff. I am drawn to its cobalt blue. It's part of the whirling in rags. There's something about this place that makes me want to know. Out of duty, we may find something pertinent to the investigation. You're right. It's not important. Let's go. Well, I'm it drawn to the blue, Kim. Pretty. I suppose we could look into it. Yes, yes, yes. A side investigation. It's a mega investigation, Kim. Hardly. Anyway, <sighs> you just wait and see, bitch. To ask about this. The cafeteria okay. manager. Let's push it the first. The door does not budge. Dang. Gart! Gart! I need... I need assistance from you. And $60, please. Can I help you? Uh, uh, so I talked to Sylvie. Wink. God. He does not look too oh, pleased. But he should be. Lay it on him. <laughs> Turns out she's a whore who likes to ride the cock carousel. <laughs> But I don't want to lay that on him. Don't I have anything else? Oh, I'm laying it on him. Wonderful. Thick. Wonderful. It is. It's wonderful. <laughs> what? What? Does that mean cock carousel? Oh, you know what it means. She rides the cock carousel until she's too old to ride it. <laughs> then she settles down with the provider. The point is you're losing at, at her nasty mind game. Sylvie's a total cycle. Just drill the inside of your mouth with your tongue. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Huh? Yeah, that. Uh, uh, uh. Yeah, this feels uh, right. It this feels, feels right. Wise. Good setup. Now speak the real shit. Yeah, man, she rides that cock until she's too old to ride it. Does it mean you talk to her? Oh fuck yeah, what else dude. What she say about me? That you don't have a good cock carousel. You're a terrible cock carousel. What else do you need? That was roughly it, uh, not gonna lie. I just wanted to lay that out, down on you. Uh, yeah, she said that she likes the cock carousel very much. So fun to spit a carousel of cocks going merrily around. Oh my god, he yes. He looks at you, spinning your arms, then leans <clears throat> on the corner and sighs. His head drops between the shoulders. Yes. Heavy and defeated. Ah, yes, I have crushed this man. She broke the bird, you know. She the did? Oh, I thought star. I did. I found it on the ground with a broken wing on the morning she left. Yeah, it was her, all right. I should have known. Not me. It was her way of telling me to piss off. I should stuff it up my ass. I can help you. I'll help you. Uh, he stops and stares at the counter. Yes. The bird is connected to this. It's a symbol of hope. 
and she broke it. <laughs> Broken bird fetters. Nod knowingly. This is all part of the mind fuck on the cock carousel. <laughs> cock carousel. Hey, he likes I it. I think I understand now. That's what they ride until like 39. 39? Damn. They ride the cock carousel until the clock runs out. Here. Huh? The rest. Fuck yeah. He takes a bottle of wine off the shelf and pours himself a glass. Fuck yeah, he gave me the rest of it. Now, awesome. let me have a drink and think about this shit for a moment on my own. Alrighty. There we have it. Isn't that beautiful? <clears throat> Another situation fixed by Dr. Love. Dr. Love, let's go, baby. Man, I did some good work right there. That was good stuff. Alright, hey, can you tell me about the uh, uh, the thing that I came right, here to ask you, you about? Uh, Another thing. Great. I love Yeah, the, the door. The door. Oh, yes, that door. Sure. There's nothing mysterious about it. It's well, where does it go? Do you know what's behind it? Do you have... No, I don't have a key. No. I don't know how to get there. How? I you own this place. Either. It's not like I've been wondering about it for ten years. It's just the frit warehouse, probably. Dude. You're t for ten years, you haven't been in behind that door. You have to be curious. Or some boring storage space with a bunch of old junk and dust. But there could be, like, dust. really fucking awesome things in there, like a Mario Lemieux rookie card or something like that. He's attempting to maintain an air of indifference. It's absolutely not convincing. I think you'd like to know what's back there. Let's be real. Fine, okay. A little. Yeah, that's right. But my job doesn't leave me time for wondering about one locked door in one of the cafeterias I manage. Well, that's not a good attitude. So, I haven't opened it. I have cleaned the whole place a hundred times over, though. After the animals. And I haven't found a key, so good luck with that. Dang. Yes? Oh, here, here. We're just never gonna talk about the money. Ever. Okay, when is this open again? Where am I going? There we go. I'm out of here. Oh, 50 cent! Oh, baby! This is the second greatest thing that's ever happened to me. Accidentally found 50 cents. Oh, I can't tell. Oh, what, uh... Should be in here somewhere. Spec, place, find, union. Yeah, what time? Uh, guard has told you the Henry Union men gather in the mess hall, the whirling in rags. They're not there today. Oh, okay, so they're just not going to be here today. Alrighty, next day then. Okay, gotcha. Gotcha, gotcha. Fuck, man, there's just one little fly down here, and it's really pissing me off. Every time. Always bothering you. Okay, I think we're going to stop the video here, and uh, make sure you guys like the video if you enjoyed it. It only takes a second, and it really helps me out. Make sure you go down in the description and check out all the links down there. Oh, what's in here? Oh, more trash. Uh, check all the description, or d check the links in the description. You go check out my podcast. Yes, I have a podcast to talk about wrestling, video games, and hockey. All three different episodes, uh, three episodes a week. So if you're looking for a new podcast out there and you enjoy any of those three topics, go over there and check it out. You might might really dig it and if you are um, want to follow along with uh, what I'm doing with the channel and the podcast make sure you follow me on Twitter I give you guys little sneak peeks at what's coming and what to expect and we can talk about all the great topics and things that are going on in hockey gaming and, and, and wrestling so if you're into that go down in the links check it out thank you so much for watching I love all of you and we'll see you again soon